What? What? Sorry? Some lady said that he did some shit. Like, specific things. <laughs> some sexual things. He's like, oh, you did all this shit to me. And he actually recorded it like. 10 years later. Like, blaring on the road and. Oh no, it's so very sketchy to me, I don't believe He raped me. Yeah, yeah, pop star is going to rape you. He well, probably gets all the pussy in the world thrown at him. Wait, what? Yeah, there's a, I'm not sure if it's proven or if it's a theory. I think it's a theory that they think that Oh, there's a point Okay, let me just Jack and Ripper was possibly the first time. Prince needs some better hobbies. <laughs> oh, one player has some tricks. So you need to use our opinion. All the stop points. The moment was scary as shit. A Jack and Ripper. But, yeah. Oh yeah, that's right, the actor. Yeah. <laughs> the movie, Bilbo. It's so the same actor, that's right, Jack the Ripper. <laughs> yeah, he plays like the creepy character. I hope he's not dead. I don't think he is. If he is, I mean, if he's not, he should do some other horror role. <laughs> yeah. I want to see Bilbo again. Well, that's I awful, I can't actually say his real name. Just yeah. like, like Rowan Atkinson, I would just call him Mr. Bean for like years upon years. <laughs> He'd be like, Rowan Atkinson! And I'd be like, who's that? And you'd see him walk on stage like, IT'S MR. BEAN! IT'S MR. BEAN! And I'd be like, holy shit, Mr. Bean! And then we all go like, Mr. Bean! Mr. Bean! And then we all go like, Mr. Bean! And then we all go like, Mr. Bean! And then we all go like, Mr. Bean! It's funny. It's funny. I like being the evil characters. Nope, Mr. Bean, the rest of your life. The only evil role you got was in the horrible Scooby-Doo movie. Oh yes, my highlight part. No. My career has come to its fruition. Scooby Doo the movie. <laughs> Scooby Doo the movie. Back up. Oh yeah, I still remember how when we were young, younger, how we made the movie freeze. On Bilbo's face, oh, yeah, turned it off, and then Mom came into the room. She's like, "What the hell is this?" Yeah, so we had it on the VCR of Lord of the Rings, and then that scene was like, "Wow!" Because he wants to pull the ring. <laughs> Paused it, turned the screen off. <laughs> Mom's like, "Oh, why is the TV off?" Turns it on. Bilbo on the screen, <laughs> <laughs> screeching. I loved it too because we were just like in another room doing something here. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember we didn't have like a wider screen at the time? <laughs> Give me my token. Whatever that is. It's medallion. Medallion. Sacred oh. talisman. It has right, the power to break the seal on the gate. I like it when they start wearing the only masks, they, but then they kind of just kind of downhill. Like, no! I enjoyed it. <coughs> oh, I enjoyed it. I was like, oh, yes, oh my gosh, so interesting. We got the press conference movie. Right. Or you can just go on YouTube. <laughs> Possibly. I don't know if they have that on YouTube. I bet they would. It was interesting to see though, um, how they like a butcher knife for second cleaver. I watched like videos on this game, not what they did the sword and stuff like that. And actually had like a sword master. How? Um, yeah, it's a sword and stuff. It's so probably they could do like the Yeah, the mo cap. The mo cap. <laughs> like, that's so ridiculous and stuff, but that's how yeah. The sword master Ash the sword master actually taught Jack these moves and he did them for the mocap. Though well, I gotta admit though, the full tornado thing makes me question what the that is. This like, one? Yes. Because it's so <laughs> like, how could he spin that fast? They probably he actually probably did stand on one foot and spin. 
but they just sped it up and tilted him a bit. Yeah. Don't forget. This one looks so retarded just seeing like a poopy pop star covered mocap gear spinning around on one foot in a circle. Well, I'm famous! Look, in Mr. Green, he played as a cannibal. Well, that's right, he has Mondays too. Yeah. He doesn't watch it. I don't like how here we're putting our celebrities in movies. Like, certain celebrities are good. But I don't like seeing, like, Katy Perry in, like, movies. Or, like, Nicki Minaj being voice actor. Whoa. Like, in the I noticed Ice Age to put Nicki Minaj as one of the elephants. And Drake as well. That's pretty good. I don't like it. It's weird. It's, well, it's not that. Gact does that. I think, he, 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 I think some other voice actor could deserve the role. You know what I mean? I'm sure there's some voice actor that needed that or could have used that gig. But instead, it's like, oh, you know what? Let's just get Nicki Minaj to voice an elephant. I think that they kind of like what they did with um, Disney. They just wrote. Oh, uh, famous people that took the old things. It's like, oh, this person, this person. Well, not, all the, not the old Disney, the old Disney just did it. Oh, yeah, there's Robin Williams. Robin Williams actually has a good voice for voice acting. Right now, now they just slap any celebrity in anything now, just to like say, oh, look, we got celebrities buying a movie. Just you know, like, Miley Cyrus or something. It's like, whoa, that's kind of cool, right? The Miley Cyrus. Well, you gotta admit, whether you like it or not, some stupid person down the line is gonna be something. So, you can. Sour, you can. I like how there says, so you set me, and then down like, so you can. Like, which is it? Oh, that's right, the water trap. You also got time for this. Hmm? Time is part of your grade. Bitch. Uses all my magic. When the person is first source of steam, they're like, oh. Okay. I know, when I first started it, <laughs> I was just like, oh look, a flood of water. Oh, I was supposed to lock onto it and press square, and then circle. For what? I'm just gonna have like 50 gallons of water hit me at like 20 miles an hour. I'm just gonna take it. Yeah. Cause I don't know what I'm doing yet! It's the first level! It doesn't even say, press R1 to lock on enemies. When being struck by magic, press square, and then circle when ready to counter. No. I kinda like that though. I hate being spoon fed. Like Dark Souls, I could have used a little more on. I guess because Dark Souls is hard as hell. Like there was, a, it was a, there was some tutorial at the beginning, but man, <laughs> it doesn't tell you how to jump or run. Actually, it does tell you how to run. It doesn't tell you how to jump. But I figured that out on my own. There was one, um, there's uh, a few games where basically, like, <clears throat> you get the, um, instructions non-stop, even though you've already learned it, and you're like, okay, you know, so I need you to tell me this, and you're like, thanks. Oh, yeah. Just gotta wait. I like that still animation with full designs, and there's the wind blowing, standing on the pole. Cheesy kung fu poses. And then there we go. Their foot isn't even on. It's oh. just random wind coming from nowhere because it's that awesome. He can fly through space. <laughs> well, yeah, true. <laughs> he can make his own wind effects. No more cat feet. I can make my own wind effects. With my butt. Yeah, exactly. Morning wind. Passing. <laughs> passing wind effects. Get the coin. That's a jump. Oh yeah, you can wall jump easily. I love the wall, it's so useful. You got seven already? Damn. And then you can glide for like a short period. Oh shoot. Yeah, they saw that. 
and wall run. Uh, in Shinobi, when you start the wall run, you kind of like walk into the wall. Yeah, you just kind of hang on there. Oh, geez. But then this one, you have like, a duration where you're just on the wall and you will fall. And you jump back onto the wall. Yeah. Mm. Undead Juggernaut. Yeah. Oh, the They're all demons, except for that thing. That wasn't undead. Still seems like a demon to me. I guess it's an undead demon. Got bit by a zombie, and now it's an undead demon. You know, there's a question about... Um, Here, I could walk that. across. Um, a zombie, oh, or... If a zombie bites a vampire, does it become a zombie, or... Well, what if a zombie bites a, bites a vampire, and then the vampire gets bitten by a werewolf? Yeah. <laughs> like you can do all those Don't you be like aware of that, right? I don't think I think that's so. in the DLC. In the DLC you can ride dragon from the vampire lore. I'm pretty sure there's Were Bear. Everybody reminds me of another game, but I won't tell. Were Bear. We're going to see that. It's hard not to talk about other games when playing. Well, I think that's it's not an eye, I just don't want to support you. The problem is with you is you can't control your mouth. <laughs> I can't! I can't stop! Ooh, just stop it! Stop it! I can't control you! I can't help myself! I'm going to stick! Oh my god, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going extinct! I'm trying to get off. Damn it, I want those orbs. There's only one orb each but one. What the hell? Why don't you grab on? You don't even have to press anything, you just jump into it and you will automatically grab on. I'm not gonna want to put that hole over there. I don't need to do anything. I just want to jump on top of it and then glide across it. Like Green monkey bar. The only thing that really is that you can't turn around in this game. Okay. I mean, like, on the poles. Oh. Remember another game where you could, like, turn around when you were hanging on something? I kind of walked on my nose. I love oh, that Chinese music! I think it was the Assassin's Creed. <laughs> Even though this is the first level, you feel like it's just the main thing for the game all around. Yeah. Well, it does get used a couple times as well, though. Extra times. Well, this you know, game has, like, awesome music all around, except for the... The desert the... temple. Yes! It's like, uh... It's like someone's in pain. Please kill them already. I hate the desert temple. It's annoying to navigate, the enemies are coming kind of fast, and the music makes you want to kill yourself. That's the next level, by the way. All sorts of roid and joys. And... Oh, wait, yeah, that's right. Bamboo Forest. Bamboo Forest is kind of a pain to navigate, too. All that fog. Oh, yeah, you know, after a while, I'm annoying to cut bamboo. Call PETA on my ass, I'm destroying animal habitats. Take out the pyramids! 